This is an update on the Dogecoin tip jar. If you saw the previous video and just want to know how to make your own, I am posting uh, the Git project with all the files and everything you need in the description or as a comment. And since last time I've decided to make it a little bit more user friendly. When you first plug it in you get to the settings screen and you have to uh, set an address. So this is the wallet address that you want the tips to be sent to. If you want to be on the safe side you can also hard code it when you're programming the microcontroller. Then you will have a fixed address that cannot be changed. Uh, at the bottom here you have the back and uh, case switch buttons. So I'm going to enter my uh, wallet address. When you enter the uh, address, make sure to double check that you entered it uh, correctly. It is case sensitive. That looks right, so I'm going to hit done. And at this point you can change the volume if you want to, or uh, you can just hit continue. And it will try to connect to Wi-Fi. On the first setup the connection will fail, and you will be uh, prompted to select a network. So I'm going to pick a network, and then I'm going to enter the password for the network. And then hit done and it should connect and then it uh, tells you when uh, the address was changed wow. connect the doge chain and then everything starts up at this point you can also uh, change the screens by clicking on it and uh, now I'm going to send 101 doge to the uh, tip address If you unplug it and plug it in again, you get back to the settings screen. If you tap the screen, it stops the countdown and you can change settings. And you can also see here your all time tips. And I can see here that I've received 202 doge. If you click the reset button, you'll reset that value. And then you can hit continue to uh, connect and uh, uh, run the tip jar.